Good day everyone, you're watching Radio Fixes. On this video, I'm going to talk about uh, how to fix a generic audio driver detected on your Windows 10 machine. Now, before I could uh, proceed, I would like to talk a bit about this error message. Now, generally, you would get this error message uh, when you try to run a Windows troubleshooter. Now, the generic audio driver detected is just an error message which will be displayed by the Windows troubleshooter when your system is running into sound or an audio issue. So whenever you encounter this error message, you try to diagnose Windows 10 audio errors and it depicts that sound devices are not behaving as they should on your Windows machine. Now, there are a couple of uh, steps what you need to try to fix the problem. Now, the first and foremost step what you need to try to fix a problem is you will have to check if your Windows audio services are running on your machine so in order to do that what you will have to do is you will have to click on search in the search window you can go ahead and type run in the once you have the run window open go ahead and type services.msc click on ok I will also put this command in the video description you can follow the steps from the video description so as soon as um, you click on ok it will take you to the services window now this shows all the services which are running on your computer. On this window, you will have to look for Windows Audio Services and check for the status. So in my case, it is a uh, status is running because um, the audio devices are working properly on my computer. I'm not getting an error message. In case if it is not running or it gives an error message uh, or it, it shows the status as stop, what you will have to do is you will have to do a right click, click on properties click on start click on apply and then click on ok and if the startup type is uh, anything other than manual or disable make sure you select automatic click on uh, apply and then start the services click on apply and click on ok again close the window and check if uh, the audio is working fine on your computer now, even after following the first step, if the issue is not resolved, then I would suggest you to go ahead and check or try the second step. Now, the second step is to go ahead and uninstall, reinstall the audio driver. So in order to uninstall and reinstall the audio driver, what you will have to do is you will have to do uh, open device manager. Now, in order to open device manager, you will have to do a right click on the start menu, click on device manager. That will take you to the device manager window under device manager window. You will have to look for sound, video, and game controllers right under this section. Now, under this section, you will have to select the problematic audio driver. So in case if you have issues with any of the drivers here, you would not see this icon. Instead, you would see a yellow color uh, exclamation mark um, right beside these uh, one of the drivers. So if you have an, any of the exclamation mark, you can go ahead and uninstall the device, restart the computer. Once you restart the computer, go ahead and um, go to device manager again under sound, video and game controllers. Click on update driver that will go ahead and update the drivers. Now, this is the second step. Even after trying this step, if the issue is not resolved, then I would suggest you to go ahead and uh, try installing the audio drivers from your uh, computer manufacturer. If it is Dell, you will have to go to the Dell uh, website, the support website, and download the latest drivers uh, from the uh, manufacturer's uh, website. Now, the, this is the third step. In case, even after trying all these steps, if the issue is not resolved, then I would suggest you to disable the audio enhancement on your computer. Now the audio enhancements is the feature uh, that is designed to upgrade the sound quality and overall performance of the audio devices. So you may not find this option. However, I will walk you through the steps. So what you will have to uh, do to do any disable the audio enhancement is you will have to do a click on the search in the search go ahead and type control panel. Go to control panel under control panel. Uh, make sure you are under the category view. Under category view, click on hardware and sound, then click on manage audio devices. Under playback tab, you will have to do a right click on the device, go to properties. Under properties, you will see an enhancement tab. In my case, it is not showing, uh, it is not displaying 
the enhancement sound here or enhancement tab so you would have the enhancement tab here so as soon as you click on, uh, as soon as you see enhancement tab you will see an option which says disable all sound effects under enhancement tab so that would be right beside the levels and in between the advanced and right beside the uh, levels so you will have to go ahead and uncheck that box once the audio enhancement is disabled then the generic audio driver problem should be resolved now in spite of trying all these steps if the issue is not resolved then i would suggest you to try any third party website to download the latest drivers on your computer now what this will do is there are certain third party uh, softwares which are available uh, over the internet which allows you to download the latest drivers from the manufacturer's portal um, uh, directly uh, into your computer so you can try this step and see if that works in case if you have any issues i would suggest you to leave a comment in the comment section so that i can come up with the uh, possible resolution i hope this video was useful in case if you like this video please make sure to hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel thank you have a great day